change something or he won't be pitching very long in this league. Standing in the leadoff man Jacoby Ellsbury. So we are ready for baseball. Center fielder Jacoby Ellsbury. Here's the first pitch to him. And underway tonight from Baltimore as the first pitch misses for ball one. Guys, the Orioles, as they begin play here tonight, they've been mired in a team wide slump of late, as with the loss last time out, they've now dropped eight of their last nine decisions. Yeah, Matty V. And you know what, D Row? This is when you really get tested. They, they call it the dog days of August for a reason. When you're struggling like this team is right now, the games get long, the schedule gets long, and you start looking forward towards the end of the season. Yeah, but you got to find a way, Dan. You know as well as I do. You got to look in the mirror. You're playing for way more, especially the way this team is underachieved. You got to keep grinding. You got to find a way to put your foot on the gas and show up to the yard every day ready to go. the 2 1 and this will miss as well so he's in danger of losing the leadoff man here tonight it's three and one now three and two to the Yankees center fielder. Hit out towards second, taken in by Scope. Throw on to first, and Ellsbury's a ground out victim to open up the ball game. With that, here's a look at the Yankees' starting lineup. Danny, who stands out to you? You know, Neil Walker is a guy that's looking to turn things around right now. He had only five RBIs the entire last month. Listen, he's a better player than that, and this could be the day he turns it around and is able to be that guy that this lineup relies on. Here's big Aaron Judge. He went deep in the contest last night. Infield in the overshift here. Now the pitch. And he'll hold off on the slider here to start the at bat. It's ball one. One oh home misses ball two. Well I think that's a great spot for that pitch in on the hands. It wasn't a strike but if he can command the movement in there he's going to be very effective in this one. Outside three and oh now. Don't go too far the dangerous Giancarlo Stanton gets his shot next. the 3-0 pitch and he lays off here ball four and he'll become the game's first base runner here with one away and with the bases empty and three balls I think they were probably just saying hey we're not going to compound our mistakes here better issue a free pass and give him something to drive so digging in now Giancarlo Stanton and he enters play today currently fifth in the American League in hitting From the stretch. That's a and the slider just stayed north of the strike zone that time. A lot of times you'll see the take sign after five straight balls to start the inning, but with the middle of the order up at the plate here, I wouldn't be surprised if he's turned loose. Just has to be the right pitch to hack at. A ball and a strike. So let's take a peek at the officiating crew in this one. Behind the plate is Kenny Jansen. 
Hey, the book on Kenny Jansen, D. Rose, not a very big zone, but he will give you that low pitch below the knees. Yeah, and he's consistent. You're okay with that as an offensive player. He wants to give that pitch below the knees. If this pitcher can execute consistently, you better make the adjustment. And he looks at one in there, one and two. The one two is swung on and missed strike three. In a double play situation, you kind of expect most pitches to be down in the zone, hoping for a ground ball. So that was an interesting pitch selection to go up in the zone. I think he caught him off guard a little bit. Into the box, Gary Sanchez. Line drive, base hit down the line. The relay, and he is in there. He was able to recognize that picture early. His eyes lit up on that one. Able to pull it down the line for a nice base hit. Here's Didi Gregorius as he will take strike one on the fastball here no balls and a strike great chance to drive in a run here in the early going and he takes strike two definitely a big pitch coming up right here he's going to be pumped if he can work his way out of this inning with the game still tied. Lifted the other way down the left field line. And this will wind up a foul ball. Pulled toward right center field. And that gets over the wall now, but both runners will score anyway. There's an interesting play right there. Base open. They elect to pitch to him. And what does he do? He hits a ground rule double, which forces the run from second and third to come in to score. Here's Neil Walker. High and deep to center field. Jones looking up. Into the bleachers and gone. Two run shot to straight away center number 10 for him on the year as the Yankees start to pull away a bit it's now four to nothing. Wow he really hit that ball well put a great swing on it with great extension and it sailed right out of here.